Hey, how's it going? It's Robert here. Welcome back to Shovel Knight. Now, we are actually approaching near, like, the end of this series, because previously in, uh, we've done, we have completed Shovel of Hope, Plague of Shadows, Spectre of Torment, but the only mode we haven't finished quite yet, yet, is King of Cards. Match Brains and Brawn in this Regal prequel. Oh, starring King Knight himself. And um we'll see how that we'll see how that goes. But first, we need to give ourselves a name. And I have had time to think about what I wanted this um nickname to be. And so may I present to you, ladies and gentlemen, Rich Man. Cause that's what we're gonna be by the end of this game. Oh, well, it's actually rich underscore, man, but imagine the underscores, imagine it's a space. So, uh, yeah, let's get started with Shovel Knight, King of Cards. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. By all appearances, peace has flourished, and carefree new pastimes have taken hold. A card game called Joustus has swept the land, and with it, word of a grand tournament. Presiding over the contest are three Joustus judges. These wise kings have been chosen to spread joy and unity. This contest is of great interest to King Knight. For those some call him a fool who plays at King, even fools know this. Whoever defeats all three Joustus judges will win an incredible treasure and be crowned King of Cards. Competing for the Joustus crown is no simple matter, but King Knight schemes, undeterred, toward a kingdom of his own. For royalty! There we are! That's, that's, the, uh, that's the story of this game. King, King Knight wants to be the winner of a card game. And so, once again, like most of the other characters, King Knight has a slightly different, um, play style. You know, because you can shoulder bash like Wario in um, the Wario Land games. And he also does a little spin that you can, you can also do on top of enemies. And that, that allows it to get to height, that allows it to get some extra height, and also you can, um, break blocks like this. Pretty neat, right? Even get gold blood now. And you can also dig into them um, little holes. Oh, there you go. Treasure here. There we go. Yeah, we're just traveling through the plains like, as, as normal. Boom, combo. Before we uh, head down to the go uh, to the goal, which is that ring thingy, there's a little secret area here on here. And down we go. Oh, hang on. Let's see what's here real quick. 
Secret. A metal. Aha. Uh -huh. These are like the, the, the new collectibles. You know how we had like kind of like curios in the last game? Well, basically these metals are now, um, what are they actually called? Merit medals, that's what they're called. All right. Anyways, back to back to the way we were going. We were going. We were going to deal with this dragon. There we go. All right. Oh, oh wait, that, that that's the goal. The, the the real goal was um back back up here. I can't. I don't think I can go back up, can I? No, I didn't. Um, dang it! Uh, I'm pretty sure that that was a that was a metal. There would be a metal up there. Dang it! I I confused this end goal for uh, the actual uh, the thing for the act thing. But oh well, we, we, we can, I can always go back and get it. But uh, yeah. If you couldn't tell by what we're seeing right now, this game is structured very differently compared to the um the other modes. Instead of just like one like long level, it's a bunch of uh, short levels themed around. So uh, yeah, that we were just in the plains Valley of Dawn. Now we're heading to Plains Mossy Mountain. So uh, let's go, Reign of Decadence. We have a uh, mossy walls here. We can't um we can't spin off those we can't spin off the um the mossy wall mossy walls. We have to find a way to do the other There's our first uh merit medal right there. bounces they did. I'm so good. I'm also good at this game. Charge into them and then you knock them out. You gotta charge at them in the front, I think. Otherwise, they don't think it'll work. But we kind of just plow through um, the, the dirt block. Oh no, you, you don't have to uh, charge at them from the um, behind. Never mind, the front. Hang on. Boop, 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 boop. There. Done. I think we are probably getting near the, the end of the end of this level, so let's get ready for that. There you 
thing is. And there we go! Level complete. And now, arrive at the homestead. Basically our house. Um, and, this, and here's our mother! Oh, my little prince, do you return to save the day with the ingredients I refer? Mother, I am no prince, I am a king, and mother, kings have subjects who do their bidding for them. Oh, my precious love, those are rats, not subjects. My rats are loyal to the last, they're my starter subjects, part of my grand plan. I must acquire a justice deck and be declared the king of cards. This is far more important than Adam's. Well, you can have your own empty stomach. Please, my valiant knight, eat. Okay. A hearty meat pie, baked with love by your mom. <laughs> Permanently gain one. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. That shouldn't make me laugh as much as it does. I've been, I've been, I've been exposed to too many your mom jokes. And now this is how my brain is wired. Yeah, this is our, uh, this is our home. Oh, oh there's the, uh, the wire thing that we, um, we came down on. I know there's a way we can get into there. That's the space there, but I don't know if we're, we can do that just yet. No, we can't. Alright. Well, anyways, I'm off, Mother. Goodbye. Now we head down here. In the plain spectral ravine. Ooh, Spectre Knights here. We already get. We already. I uh, mean, in the first order, no quarter already. That's good. Yeah, Spectre Torment music. Nice. You bounce off this line turn. You can also kind of uh, chain off the um, shoulder bashes. After, it has to be after you do like the twirl, so that way it like you know it properly works. Because otherwise it, it it won't work. So you you gotta you gotta you gotta remember that. You gotta remember you gotta remember that for future reference. Okay, guys, this will be on the test. <laughs> Damn it. No. There we go. We're all right. We're all right. We're still living. We're still living. We're still living. For the most part. I don't have to kill him again, do I? Oh, god dang it. There we go. All right. Let's, uh, let's get going now. Swordsman over there. Yeah, there's two of them down there. I can just kill him.
Aha! These uh, ring things I was talking about. Oh, I just got it. This is actually take you to like a bonus little uh, stage you can do. These are the little challenges in them. There we go. Off we go. So when I so when you know when I said a while back I, I mentioned that the like King of Cards might be my might have been my long, might be my longest playthrough. I was referring to you know the level structure because I don't know if it will be my longest playthrough. I don't know because so far that title goes to Plague and Plague of Shadows at like nine episodes or something. But uh, we'll see. Anyways, it looks like we're coming up to the boss and let's see what our Spectre Boy has in store for us. Also, I'm pretty sure this. Also, I'm pretty sure this story takes place before Spectre Torment. So, um, keep that in mind. Your quest to become King of Cards has not gone unnoticed. Ah, word has reached the slums, has it? Am I to travel with an entourage of ma many mangy beggars now? You shall remain silent and heed my words well. You stole uh, no chance of. Out of my way, you reeking husk! I want you, my panhandlers, on my path to the jousters' crown! A child, in the guise of a monarch, I will teach you respect and the true meaning of fear! This is, uh, this is like, this is like, in from Spectre Torment. This is exact sprite here. I put all of our skills to use, all of our shoulder bashing and spin jumps. ha -da! And he strikes the landing! Ah, you are impudent, but quick on your feet. Interesting. Horrors! You touched my cape! Now I must launder away your disgusting filth! Take these, and waste no more of my time. Joustus deck. A starter deck of Joustus cards. Finally, your card quest can begin. A Joustus deck? Did you, did you soil it with your witchery? They're ordinary Joustus cards, you simpleton. Seek the nearest house of Joustus, and play your role. Alright then. Alright, so now that we've, um... I actually went back and uh, got the um, the um, the merit medal that I missed in the first level. But um, now that we've done that, uh, let's continue on. Let's explore the first house of Joustits. Kind of a hub world area, sort of. Any cool? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I can have uh, man. Yeah. yeah. Oh, hello. Rookie. Smite it all. Had such a fine run I did. Ha! I'll never be good enough to challenge King Pride more. My, my. Is that a brand new Justice deck? Perhaps we could go over the rules together. My mind is as honed as my armor. I need no prior experience to defeat a knave at cards. Stand aside! I mean no disrespect, your highness, but you'll be trounced and your riches squandered without proper advice. It'd be wise and um, valorous for us both to practice Joustus, my lord. Yeah, so this guy will give us a tutorial on how to play Joustus, which is kind of the secondary game mode of um, House of King of Cards. But it's also completely optional. You don't have to do this at all. You can, you can play the entire game without even touching this game, so Joustus. So. Ready for a bit of a brush up on the card playing parlance, sire? I can show you guys how it is in place, so here we go, King Knight versus Rookie. To win Joustice, you have to claim more gems than your opponent. To start, pick a card from your hand and place it on the board. Maybe Propeller Rat. Here. If your card covers a gem, you claim it, but you can't just place a card onto a gem. You have to push on, push it on. Arrows indicate which direction your card can push. Push the card you already placed to claim the gem. Like this. Like 
As you can see, I claimed the gem by pushing your card up. Push the card right to reclaim the gem for yourself. Oh, but you see, you can't push there. Your card is blocked by an opposing arrow. There's still a way to push my card off the gem. You can insert your card in between. Put it here. Put it here. The match is almost over. The game ends when the center squares are full. Each player must place a card on their turn, but the only move I can make will lose me the game. My hand is forced. That was the old art to speed up. That's cool. You're one. Open squares are full. There we go. That's how you. Um, that's how you play. Um, Justice. That's an optional game you can you can play. I might do. I, I'll, I'll play it for you guys. I'll probably only maybe do like a major sessions, uh, mostly. Oh, yeah. A fine match, my lord. It's lovely to play for fun. In real games, the winner takes a card. You know, for keeps. All right, cool. I'm um I'm gonna leave now. You there, you, the pauldrons! Fancy pants, yes, you! I, My friends, I have an offer for you. We need to talk elsewhere. Sorry, petitioners, I am not accepting gifts from peasants, and I won't have a word of your pleasant. Does the Justice crown ring a bell? We bid you no harm and wish to hear your story. Please, your highness? Hmm, finally some recognition of my status. Very well, I'll hear you out. Heave to and grab the rope. Oh, here we go. We're off! And here is our new hub world, the uh, flying ship. This ramshackle monstrosity seems ready to splinter to bits, but I must say, this view of my future kingdom is quite remarkable. My glidewing is a sturdy lass, and my few of fortune seekers depend, depend, depends on her, and we turn a mighty profit. And lately, we've had our eyes on the Jousters' crown. But we need a champion who can outplay King Brightmore. And you, my friend, certainly look the part. Oh, I assure you, the Jousters' judges will be small work for a talent such as my own. Your Grace, I believe we have an understanding. If we work together, the glory will be ours. First up is King Brightmore, a bearded noble with a razor whip. We're in Eric's domain, Brightmore Keep. But it will be a moment yet. Have a stroll around the glide wing and rest up. I'll come aboard. Oh god! Oh god! I, I can't do that voice for long. Read the same bar. King Knight, you dazzle me with your gleam. A moment, if I may. Why? I do feel rather regal today. What troubles you, Bog? Merit medals. You see, I've realized that those brave enough to find them have most interesting tales to tell. Most interesting indeed. Perhaps I could take a peek at your majestic collection to inspire a melody. Ten merit medals, you're quickly becoming a bard in your own right. It's not much, but I've saved 900 gold to mark the occasion. Would you accept it? Then yeah, why not? I have another form of patronage, sire. Please, allow me to regale you with a verse you've inspired. <clears throat> As he trod through the grass, o'er the hills of the plains, the king's cleanest trouser grew soiled with stains. Abroad from his castle, aloft in the sky, he traded his king... He traded his kingdom for a flagon of lie. Oh, little globe. Let's look at explore this little hop world, the glide wing. Little, uh, you're a little lady here. Hello. Ah, another traveler joins our airfaring crew. I'm Cardia, and I have a great interest in this land's diversions. Justice shines light on the heart. Shall we glimmer together? Pretty sure she's challenging us to a. No, but we're not we're gonna deny for the now. It's the um the fairy. And there's Chester! Fancy seeing you here, your highness! The glide ring is full of the types that love to buy me my merchandise. Why don't I have a look? So basically, um the Chester here can offer you some um I uh, guess for mostly joustus stuff. Buying rent buying a mystery card and then getting some cheats, but um we're not playing Joustus really just yet, so uh, we'll hold off on them for now. Let's explore some more, shall we? Some stuff over here. Hello. Engineer. Surprised to see you here in the back, fancy pants. And the Gladwing Greeks, I'm the gal of the Greeks. I do a little freelancing bending too. Wanna see? 
This is also where we could um, get some upgrades for um, King Knight. Hey, we have Healing Tears. Hold down to cry your heart out and restore health. I mean, crying is good for Yig. Wealth Whirl. Spin to absorb nearby gold. But, um, uh, yeah. Let's go spell it here. Vicar of Vigor. Hell, I sense unease regarding my presence. Dost thou wonder if why an apparition stands before you? Well, not really, no. In life, I was called the Vicar of Vigor. You may have seen my many statues scattered across the land. Nope, didn't see any. Alas, as prophesied, I cannot find eternal rest, as I have no one upon whom to bequeath my treasured heirlooms. Perhaps you'd agree to take them off my transparent hands? Yeah, sure. We have, uh, we have the Healing Hammer, Pound Health Hearts out of your enemies, and the Propellered Blitz Steeds, Send Forth a Flying Lens. I'll take the Healing Hammer, because, um, you know, getting health is cool. There's a secret down here. Really was like something we could get. Yeah. Ring this bell. And yeah, it's Grammar Swamp. Hello. As all has been written, let not thy fate wane. For when the bell tolls, thy deeds shall lay plain. What shall I reveal? Adventure. Request boy for uh, the number of times you've fallen in battle is zero. Very cool. Temperate Stalio, the total time you spent adventuring is 30 minutes and 8 seconds. Opotarium Intrusio, the number of shoulder bashes you've done is 319. Cartetium, you've found 5% on the exit. Aorum Infiniosa, the amount of gold you've collected is 9,348. Ah, uh, it's nice to meet someone who's a true student of me. How do you keep such track of such, track of such details, which I see and I know all because I'm not a witch. <laughs> right. I do remember there's like a little secret you can do with a plane, but maybe we can't do that yet. But, um, yeah, well. Oh, yeah, I also forgot. Um, you can also press the shoulder bat dash bash button twice, and, um, King Knight will do a little roll. That, that'd be, that's useful. Hello, sir. Go. Hey there, King Man. I pilot this dainty little clipper, and I steer. They're true. Name's Doe, at your service. You're cleared for departure. When you're ready, just leap off the bow. Okay. So now we've done that. You can, uh... Oh, Baz. Baz is here. So, um, we could do one of four things. We could go to the Lich Yard. Start Lich Yard. We can start work on, um, Pride More Keeps. We can go to this Backyard Lab. Or we can battle Baz. Um, let's battle Baz, why not? Hello, sir. Hey, nice armor, Pine. But beware, this is a private training spot. You're interrupting some private training. King Knight needs no training. I'm ordering you well on my way to defeating the Joustus judges. When I do, I'll take the Joustus crown and the title of King of Cards. Whoa, a fight with judges, isn't it? And if you beat them, you get to take the... Title? Now, wait just a moment. A title isn't. And if you're King Knight, that means beating you would make me a king and a knight? That's not exactly how it... King Knight, this bout is for the title. I mean, titles. Are you prepared to get wrecked? All right, we got to fight. Baz. Oh, oh God. Um. Messing up his, uh, his, his little gin. Go to Horn again. Oh. Never mind. Yeah. I missed. Spin around like he's Sonic the Hedgehog.
Oh god. Alright, there we go, we hit him. Ow. Dang it. We got him! Hooray! That's actually how the uh, the arena for Baz's um fights in um Shovel of Hope and Plague of Card and Plague Plague of Shadows happens. You know this gold chest rolling room. That was a little extra level. Like the little challenge levels we had in the aforementioned Hedge Farmer. Whoa, are you okay? Looks like your video got knocked out. But that's okay, because this is the roll court. Rolling is great. You can sail through dirt and get more distance without stopping or spinning up. Just quickly press Y again during your shoulder bash, but watch your spacing. You need a little runway. And yeah, I actually, um, when I first played King of Cards, I had a lot of trouble with the rolling tutorial. I don't know why. You gotta give yourself a little bit of leeway. You, you need at least a little space. Dang it. No! No! This is what I meant. Some of the timing can be a little uh, awkward, you know? There we go. Some more money. And let's go. Ooh, treasure done. Um. I'm sure we want to do this yet. Uh, let's do, let's start, let's make a start on Pride More, around Pride More Keep. Let's do uh, Pride More Keep Bounding Battlement. I think we might do this level and maybe um, I want, and then yeah, I believe this level is a secret exit. We uh, need to keep an eye out for her. Yeah. Obviously, as, as standard as Pride More Keep, there is usually a secret. Can you go back? Ooh! Decree of Rejuvenation, a single-use item. Summon a friendly trap to restore health and vigor for 25 seconds. Alright, so this is kind of like, oh, like the potions work. In, in, the, the potion thingies worked in a Shovel of Hope. So that's cool. Do we get the Yacht Club Games logo? We do! Staple. Oh god! So yeah, we're here in, um, this is, um, Pride Keep before, um, King Knight took over. We have these little, uh, spinning, spinning bounce pads here. They're cool. That's, uh, kind of one of the gimmicks in this level. So that's cool. There's a bunch of um, other rats here. And there's um, there's the uh, metal. And oh, I'll immediately lose some of it. Is that the way to go, or is 
Uh, oh wait, I, no, I'm pretty sure this is this this path here is the secret way to the secret exit. It's a red ladder. Usually, usually what it means. Let's see what this way is. I'm pretty sure that's the signal for AO. You found the secret. You found you're on the secret path. Good luck. And there is a um. There's a merit medal there. Need a red thing. We have a red gold here with red rats to boot. Obviously, we didn't get the uh, the third merit medal, but we could probably do that next episode. We have Turncoat's Tower. Actually, no. Let's uh, let's pay a quick visit to Backyard Lab. See what we have. Hello. Psst, over here, sire. It's me. Thanks for dropping by for the test. I finished up our secret to fight. But the matter materials aren't free, remember? I need merit medals to pay off our suppliers. Rat Bombardier. Release the rat with a safety bomb attached. Yeah. Here we go. Yeah, while it's running, I press again to reverse its direction. Designed my safety bomb, it shields the rat from harm. Can you reach the far end of the forest? And by the way, don't shoulder bash in this cave. There are still a few kinks on your motion sensors. Could end badly. So like with, um, Spectre Torment, you got, um... We earn these, um... Heirlooms, and we have to, um... Beat them... Beat the, uh, the course by using them. And, um, mm. see what we have to do. Mm. And oftentimes we're not allowed to, um, use our, um... I'm not allowed to use, um, our attacks and all that. So... Mm. My phone going off. I can't tell. I don't know. You know, and the rats can walk over the um, spikes. That's convenient for them. <laughs> Not what I meant to do. Here we go. Okay, I'm probably just my phone buzzer, but I'll try. Um, I'm really, I'm really sorry, guys. I'm sure someone's trying to call me. Probably something very important, and I'm dead. Sorry. I'll answer them off screen. In three days. So, um, yeah. We'll get to the end of this course and then we'll um, end the episode. That's um, that's how we'll do this. I'm sorry. Someone's really trying to call me. Maybe I can't answer it now. I was literally right at the end. The rat bomb is here work. Thanks to your field test, King Knight. We'll be ready for production in no time. Yes, splendid. Why not come aboard my royal airship? Then, and enjoy and, and enjoy a well deserved glimpse of my domain. After all this research, I could use some fresh air. Lead the way, sire. Alright, there we go. And now the, uh, the house phone's ringing. I'm, I'm really sorry, but, uh, I'll, I'll, end, I'll, end, I'll just end this like right now. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like down below, comment, subscribe, click the notification bell so you don't miss an upload made by me. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.